Hey guys, Hillary Smith here, and I decided to do a little impromptu essential oils 101 class. I was working on my schedule and going over some notes for my classes, and I was like, why not do a Facebook Live class? We're all busy, right? We moms have a million things going on, and sometimes it's really hard, even though we want information and we want to go to things, sometimes we just can't always find the time in our schedules. So, I know I'm super busy, and we've just had all sorts of things come up, you know, left and right, and so I love that I can teach a class this way. So, I love Facebook Live for this purpose. So, I thought I would do a little Facebook Live Essential Oils 101 with you guys today. So, um, this will be a little bit longer, but it's some great information, and you can ask questions, and then at the end I will go back and answer them. So um, let me know if you can hear me, if you can see me. Sometimes I have trouble with my Wi-Fi or my internet or whatever, so just let me know if you can hear me and see me. If you can't hear the volume uh, with Facebook Live videos, just exit out and then come back in and you should be good to go. So um, while people are jumping on, I am gonna show you one of my most favorite ways. Hi, honey, where are you watching from? He has babies in the back bedroom. Looks like my husband is on. <laughs> um, so while people are jumping on, I'm gonna show you one of my most favorite ways lately to use essential oils. And actually, I bought one of these bracelets and my husband stole it and he calls it a wristband because he says men can't wear bracelets, so he calls it a wristband. But um, I love this little essential oil diffuser bracelet and this one is like woven leather. I got it on Amazon. Uh, if you want the link, I can give it to you. But I love taking my stress away. One of my most favorite oils, one of my first oils I fell in love with. It smells so good. I wish you could smell it. Um, I love just rolling it on. You can dab it on too. You can put a few drops, but I love just like rolling it on. It's so easy. And guys, <laughs> I kid you not, and Josh can testify. Um, I'm like smelling this thing all day long. In fact, when I don't have it on, I totally feel lost. Hey, Andrea, how are you? Um, and I, in fact, my daughter stole this one, so now I have to get myself another one. And this is actually the kid-sized one. Josh has the adult-sized one. But oh, when you're driving and dropping the kids off at the school drop-off and pick-up, right, you can be sniffing this. This will make you a better and godlier woman, I swear. Jesus gave us oils for a reason, moms right here. So you can also use diffuser necklaces. They even make diffuser earrings I saw that I want to get. They're like leather and you can put your drops of oils on the back of your earring. How cool is that? Um, all sorts of things you can do to diffuse um, on the go as moms and help us deal with some of those everyday stressors. But Stress Away comes in the premium starter kit. I love it. I popped on my roller fitment like literally as I opened up my box I was like give me all the oils. I think I was like rolling this one on like crazy. I went through it so fast. Um, so this one comes in the kit and we'll talk about that one in a little bit. But first, I wanna kinda of cover some just essential oil goodness and information with you all. Um, but before we get started, one of the main things I tell everyone, I know this is crazy, I'm not a medical professional. I'm not a doctor, I'm not here to treat or diagnose or cure or recommend specific oils for any diseases or anything like that. Um, this information is just for educational purposes um, and I just, I really, um, I, I can't address any of those things. So we as Young Living um, educators, we just can't speak in that way. Uh, but instead, we can talk about wellness and supporting our bodies and how Young Living essential oils are incredibly good for your health and support all your body systems. So then you're not needing to do, you know, all of that worrying about sickness and all that stuff. So um, anyway, so if you ask me certain questions, I can't address them per the FDA. We really like to stick within compliance and it's like a big thing with, with us Young Living educators. We really try to stick with how the FDA asks us to share. So, um, but onto the fun stuff. I'm a girl who loves her essential oils and one of my most favorite things is getting to share and educate and empower other moms and people. So, um, I've been with Young Living for just under a year now. I started this journey when my two youngest kiddos were just desperately needing some wellness and immune support. 
um, and I want to keep it short, but basically Young Living fell into my lap and was an answer to prayer in more ways than I was even praying for. I didn't even realize, but it was just, it was such an answer to prayer. And I started this journey for my babies and for my big kids and just for the health and wellness of my family. But I soon discovered that I was the one really needing oils and young living in my life the most in just so many ways. Um, as I learned more and more about essential oils, I found out that they support your hormones, they support our bodies as moms, they can help us with everyday stressors of life, um, just so many endless possibilities. It's like opening up Pandora's box with essential oils. There's so much that they can do. Um, so. The one thing that was funny though is I just, I swore I would never take on like another <laughs> home business. I was feeling really burnt out with, um, I had done another journey and another home business and I was just feeling really burnt out. I was feeling like I just didn't have time in my life. Um, I was terrified of doing live videos and public speaking and I was like, I will never teach a class. I'm just going to use my oils, love my oils, have them benefit my family. Um, and I just felt like we had so much on our plate at the time. I didn't need one more thing. And then I found out I was so incredibly wrong and it was exactly what I needed. Um, but I got my kit and I went like full speed ahead. I just dove into everything essential oils, did tons of research, found out so much information. And I, I really don't know how people buy these kits and then they just let them sit on their shelves gathering dust. Like, I wanna come over to your house. If you have a kit that is gathering dust, like please let me come over to your house and I will show you how to use your diffuser. I will show you how to use your oils. I'll make it really simple, but don't just let them sit there because they are so powerful and so useful. Do not let them just sit in the dust. Um, Seriously, if you find me knocking on your door, just answer it, open it up, it's all good. I brought some Thebes cleaner and maybe we'll clean some stuff too. So, uh, but the thing is you are going to see results when you are consistent and when you use these products daily. Essential oils, you can't just use them like here and there and every once in a while and maybe once a month. You have to use them consistently and you have to use them daily and then you are going to see results, trust me, I promise. So, that's what I did. I got my kit and I started using them on both our babies. Uh, we had a two month old and an almost two year old and I was just using them for immune and wellness support. Um, and then, uh, you know, I opened that stress away and I realized that I could use them on myself for emotional support and boosting my own health and energy, which I was desperately needing. And it was so amazing. I saw such amazing results just for my, myself. Uh, we ran out of oils and fight over the, over the what, honey? My husband's commenting and he's distracting me. Um, he's in the back bedroom. He should just come out. I fell in love and guys, what I swore I wouldn't do, I booked my first class. I was like, I've got to share these oils. These are amazing. People cannot be missing out on this. I have to share this. So I booked my first class. I was super, super nervous, um, but I had my little script and I had people that came and I read my little script and I shared my oils and I shared my heart and the rest is list, uh, history. And I would share with anyone who would listen. Who remembers my Lunch and Learn series when I first start, started? I was like on fire. I was so excited to share with everyone. I did this whole Lunch and Learn series where I went over every single oil. If you tuned into that, let me know with like a little thumbs up. That was really fun. So um, anyways, who that's listening either now or on the replay is a Young Living member? Don't you all just love it? Isn't it just the most life-changing thing ever? And don't you just feel like you want to share with everyone just how amazing it is? Um, you know, all the hearts for Young Living Oils. So I also want to welcome any non-oily members because soon you will be future oily members. And I am so excited that you are here and ready to learn with me today. Um, you each have various reasons why you might want to learn and try essential oils. We all have different things that we want to address with our bodies or with our families or with our health and wellness. And I just want to say I am so glad that you are here because it is for a reason. Um, and as I begin, I want to start off by saying you are about to take a new step into something that is going to be seriously life changing. It is an awesome, awesome ride. But what we don't always realize is the choices that we make 
every single day, big or small, they either fight disease or they contribute to it. So it happens little by little, day by day, choice by choice. It's not just about the food we eat and how much you exercise that contribute to a healthy lifestyle. Now, some people want to start with like exercise and diet and they think that's the thing that is going to help bring health and wellness. But there's so much more to it. That would be like deciding that you want to, you know, embark on a health journey and you're just going to eat broccoli every day. You know, our bodies don't work that way. They're a whole system. And so it's diet, it's exercise, it's what we are putting in our bodies and what we are putting on our bodies and what we are breathing into our bodies and the air around us. So, uh, yes, diet and exercise, they're super important, great, 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 but what you may not realize is what you put on your body and breathe in your home matters just as much, if not more. And what we are cleaning our homes with matters more in our health and wellness journey. And sometimes it's not just about what we're eating and how much we're exercising. Um, did you know that the air that you breathe inside your home can be anywhere from five to 10 times more polluted than the outside air? And I'm sure my husband is researching this statistic as I'm saying it, but our air in our home, uh, all the things that we use in our home, they stay in our home. And this is due to our home sometimes being really inadequately ventilated. So every single product that you are using inside your home stays in your home for you to breathe in. Among the worst offenders, and guys, when I got my kit, I think I went around with a trash can and I threw so much away and my husband was a little upset with me because we are so big on not wasting things. But I was like, I don't want to give this to someone else. I don't want to pass this on to someone else because I don't want to be using anymore. So things like candles, you guys, I had candles, you know, all over, uh, plugins, wax burners and sprays. I had these all over my house and just think about all those chemicals and all those, all that stuff is staying in your home and you're breathing it in cleaning products, fabric softeners, dryer sheets, and much more. When I started with oils, I started realizing all those things that we had in our home and I went around and we just started, you know, slowly some things we ditched and switched as we ran out and some things I was like, I'm done. I'm overusing you. I will not support those products any longer. And I feel like we can, as consumers, um, say to, uh, companies, we don't want this in our homes anymore. We don't want these in our products. And that is like the biggest voice I think is just choosing not to buy those things. So you guys, I get it. Um, I know all this information can be really overwhelming and be a little bit scary. It's a lot at first. I felt the same way the first time I heard all these facts and I started looking at all my products and I was scanning them with the Think Dirty app and I was going to the ewg.org website and I was looking at things and seeing what they were doing to our bodies and to our home. Um, but the thing is that they are facts. You can Google all this information. You can look up all your products. You can see what is in them. And for the sake of our health and our future, I no longer want to turn a blind eye and I don't want anyone else to turn a blind eye. I want to be able to empower others and pass on the information that we are learning. And guys, I get it. It's a process and we are still in that process. There are things we are still replacing and learning more about. And so it is a journey, but you guys, I really want you to understand knowledge is power. Having knowledge, it makes you powerful and we as women especially and even if you guys are watching some of you guys are gatekeepers to your homes but we as women are the gatekeepers of our home we are the ones who go to the stores we are the ones who shop um, or maybe you do it as a team but parents and adults are the gatekeepers of our home and we choose what we bring into our homes and we can tell companies what we choose to buy and what we choose not to buy um, but you are the best caretaker for you and your family. No one else is. No one else is making those decisions about what comes into your home. So wouldn't you agree that living a more chemical-free life is important for you and your family's health? I think we could all agree on that. But sometimes we just don't know. And so knowledge is power. 
So that's what I'm here to help you with today. I want to help you learn um, just how diverse and amazing essential oils are and the numerous ways that you can use them to change that and bring in more natural things into your life and get rid of some of the, the chemicals and some of the things that are doing your body harm. Um, I want to show you how you can ditch some of those synthetic toxins and switch over to something that will benefit your body, your mind, your overall well-being in the most perfect and plant-based way. So what are essential oils, right? I know a lot of people ask that. You see them everywhere. Think pink with oils. Um, honey, I don't even know what that means. Think pink with oils. Um, what are essential oils, right? They're these little bottles. You're probably wondering what are, you know, what are essential oils? These potent oils are often called the lifeblood of the plant because they are the oxygenating cells for the plant. And if you read anything about disease or health and wellness, oxygen is super important. So plants that are getting really good oxygen are very healthy plants. So you're taking the lifeblood of that plant that is oxygenating the cells and you are using it and applying it to your own body. Um, think about when you a plant gets injured, the sap of that plant will go and help heal and mend that part of the plant. So basically, um, we are taking that essential oil of the plant that goes to that area and helps heal and mend it, and we are using it on our own bodies. So in humans, they have the capability to support every single body system. No matter which way you're using them, they can support every single body system. You're basically taking that plant's immune system and applying it to your own body. They support everything from healthy brain function to healthy weight management and also for healthy emotions as well. And so, um, especially as moms and parents, we are like in the hardest times of our lives. And I have learned how amazing essential oils can be just for emotional support alone. I think that was the thing that sold me the most at first. Just the, the difference between um, the moment I before I use essential oils and after and just how quickly they can work to just calm and help me deal with some of the everyday stressors. So wouldn't you all agree that there are times when you need some emotional support in your life? I know that I do all the time, especially with four little kids, four and under. Hence the diffuser bracelet and the diffuser necklaces and the diffuser earrings. I'm like all day long. I know Josh can testify that some days we're both there like, okay, let's go deal with this toddler. So an essential oil is amazing. In a diffuser, it can soothe a child who has had a really tough day, whether it's school or just at home. Um, it can calm kids before bedtime and it can calm us moms. I know that when I'm rubbing my kids down with oil, sometimes at bedtime, it's helping me calm down. Um, it can relax you after a long day at work, especially if you take some oils and put them in Epsom salts and take a nice spa bath. Amazing. But they also can be very invigorating, uplifting, and energizing. Essential oils can also be used as an alternative to toxic cleaning chemicals in your home. We use thieves and lemon and all sorts of things to clean our home without having to use toxic chemicals. And you guys, if you don't believe me, I will come to your house with my bag of tricks and I will prove it to you. Trust me, I will. Just ask me. Um, it makes it so easy to get a jump start in ditching those toxins and switching to a healthier alternative. You will soon find out that Young Living is so much more than essential oils. You guys, they have over 500 products that are all natural, plant-based, that will completely remove toxins and chemicals from your home. You guys, they have makeup, Savvy Minerals. I'm wearing it right now. It has zero chemicals, zero toxins. It is the most natural, <laughs> it is the most natural um, makeup out there. I swear, and it's actually really super supportive of your skin. So you guys, Young Living has everything you can possibly imagine. Yes, babe, we are doing dollar margaritas at Applebee's tonight. Yes, we are, and thank you. Because see, on Sunday I get all dressed up for church, and so I'm like, babe, we need to do date night on Sundays because 
I look good and I'm already ready to go. So let's do it. Cause some days he comes home and I'm just tired and I haven't showered and all sorts of stuff. Anyway, that's when we break out the yelling, yelling, the energy, the all sorts of good stuff. I could tell you that will help support a happy marriage. That's another thing that oils can do. So, but today, today, Josh, help me focus. We are going to be talking about the premium starter kit, which is the most amazing thing ever in the entire world. If I had to grab, you know, one thing to take with me to a deserted island, it would be my premium starter kit and my big giant box of oils. I would take it all with me. So, but today we are going to talk about the premium starter kit, which is how everyone gets started when they begin their young living journey. Everyone, because it's such an amazing value. It's like getting everything in the kit 50% off you guys. And I don't know about you, but I'm a bargain hunter and I love when I get 50% off. So at only $160, it gives you all the essential oils you need to jump right in. And I'm not kidding, I, I kid you not, it has everything you need to jump right in. Covers all body systems with this amazing kit. Um, and a bonus, you guys, it comes with a diffuser. That's that's my new favorite diffuser. I'm loving this Dudop diffuser right now. It also comes with the home diffuser, but I loaned it out to a friend who was needing some wellness and immune support and so I haven't gotten it back from her yet, which is awesome. I love that I'm loaning out diffusers to people who need them. If you need a diffuser, and you need some wellness support, hit me up. I will gladly drop it off to you to use for a while. You can loan those bad boys. Um, anyways, do drop, you get a diffuser, and you get these amazing oils. I've got my diffuser going right now. It has Christmas spirit and pine, you guys. It smells so stinking amazing right now. In fact, um, it is everyone's most favorite way to use essential oils, I think. It's my most favorite way. You guys, my house smells so good right now, and people will tell you how good your house smells with essential oils. Naturally, no junk, and it is supporting and benefiting your health at the same time and making you a happier mom. Yes, please, sign me up right now, right? Uh, pumpkin spice, I make my own amazing pumpkin spice blend with orange and thieves and nutmeg and clove and ginger. It's to die for, it smells so good. You guys, so many fall scents you can use with essential oils, but guys, this is one of my favorite right now, even though it's not even like Christmas. Christmas spirit, it smells like Christmas in a bottle. I think I bought like five of these bad boys right now. But yeah, we can totally run around town dropping off diffusers at date night. Yep, totally. So, um, anyways, naturally you can make your house smell so good. So with a diffuser, all you do, it's so simple. You just add water and essential oils that you're choosing in any blend or mix that you want. Um, and it will take those essential oils and it disperses them into the air. And some people ask me, is it hot or cold? It's like a cold mist. So it's kind of, it doubles as a humidifier, which is awesome. So if you need like some um, humidifying, humidification, I don't even know how those are words, but if you need some humidifying, it works that way too. Um, so when you diffuse essential oils, it can help you rediscover peace, balance, joy, but it also can be energizing and invigorating as well as purifying and cleansing to the environment around you. All in a diffuser? Is that not the most awesome thing ever? It can make you happier, calmer, healthier, and invigorated and energized, and your house is going to smell amazing. You can have peace of mind without compromise when diffusing Young Living essential oils. So not only are you making your house smell absolutely stinking amazing, well not stinking, because it doesn't stink, it smells amazing, you aren't damaging your health like those other nasty fragrance sprays, wax warmers, candles, and plug-ins. You guys, go look those up and see what's in them. Some of them have carcinogens. You guys, you're literally putting things that cause cancer into the air for your children and your family. And our homes are not ventilated properly and all that junk is staying in your home. Don't do it guys, please don't do it. So using essential oils for diffusion, soothing baths, massage, hello happy marriage, and topical application is a must, which goes into my next usage. So topical application is another one of my favorite, favorite uses for Young Living essential oils. In fact, this might be too much information, but I think it's what young, uh, won my husband over because I was like, babe, I'll rub you down with some oils. And he's like, okay, sign me up, right? What husband doesn't want to be rubbed down with some essential oils? 
So, but proper usage is really, really important when you are using essential oils. So they, on each little bottle, it tells you exactly how to use it, how to dilute it, you know, what you can do with it. Um, so the idea though of a little is good and a lot is better. So like if a little essential oil is good, though, then a lot is better. It's not always correct because the cool thing is, is these essential oils are super powerful and you don't always need a ton to see results. In fact, sometimes, you know, you can really make your oils stretch if you're just using like a little bit at a time. Essential oils are very potent and powerful. And so whenever you get started with essential oils, I always recommend you guys just to start slow and you know, start low and go slow and just see how your body reacts. We use essential oils really differently now that we've been using them longer. There's oils I don't even dilute anymore and I use them a lot more. But when I first started, I really started slow and just listened to how my body was reacting to the essential oils. Um, Everything that touches your skin, your shampoo, your deodorant, your makeup, your lotion is getting absorbed into your body through your skin, which then carries those toxins to your delicate organs. A lot of people think that our skin is this amazing barrier and it, you know, blocks all these things from getting into our body, but the truth is our body, um, our skin is actually an amazing carrier. And the more you use essential oils, you find out how you can apply essential oils to your feet and they will be carried throughout your entire body. So think about if you are cleaning your floors that your babies walk on and crawl on or your toddlers are on with toxic chemicals, your feet are carrying all those throughout your entire body. So you really want to be careful about what you're cleaning your house with. Um, so most people, when they think of getting healthy, they just solely focus on their diet and adding an exercise, which yes, is very, very important. But what you should also be concerned about when you're thinking about health and wellness is what is coming in contact with your skin on a daily basis. And you guys, I hate to inform you of this, but a lot of those companies are self-regulated and they are putting things in your products that have never been tested um, when using them every single day, using them all combined together. Um, they don't test them that way. They don't know the effects on our bodies, but we're starting to see effects. We're starting to see infertility. We're starting to see the rise of like ADD. We're starting to see the rise of autism. We're starting to see the rise of cancer. We're seeing all these things rise and we're having more and more toxic chemicals being put into our products. What do you think is going to happen? Um, your skin has literally no filter. It is our largest organ and it's not a barrier. It is a carrier of all those things. The average woman before she leaves her house in the morning um, is putting on over 300 chemicals to her body and 80% of those just before breakfast. Doesn't that worry you a little bit when you think about all the things that we as women use to make ourselves smell good, look good, fix our hair, put under our arms, all sorts of things. Those are all in your body and those have never been tested to see how they react when they are used in our bodies that way. Um, there's something called bioaccumulation. Look that up because it's really important when you start adding up all the different products that you're using every day and how all those things accumulate in your body and cause harm. So are you starting to think about all the products that you have been using for years? I really felt the same way. I started looking at everything differently and I know it took my family and my husband a little bit longer to get on board and I'm still fighting those teenagers a little bit because they love their products. But when you start to hearing that some of these facts, it's shocking. Um, but I'm so very thankful that I have learned some of this information and that I get to pass it on to others. Fragrance, fragrance, that word really makes me mad because companies use that word on labels. It can house hundreds and hundreds of chemicals legally under one word. There could be a laundry list of chemicals and all they have to put is fragrance. If you see fragrance listed on any of your products, I want you to start questioning what that word fragrance means. And I want you to get rid of it for the health and wellness of you and your family. Um, it is never ever too late to start making healthier changes and start ditching some of those chemicals. Our bodies are, have this amazing power to heal and to detox and to get rid of all that stuff. Um, 
Wouldn't you agree that it's never too late to make a better start? Another way to use essential oils is internally. So Young Living's Vitality line, and the Vitality line is just these white labels. So this is a bottle of lemon, and it's the uh, Vitality bottle, and it has this white label, which tells me that this is for dietary and internal use. I can use this as a supplement. Um, they are grass or grass approved, and grass just st stands for generally regarded as safe for internal use by the FDA. Um, the purpose behind the Vitality oils is just that they are just the, it's just the label. The white label just means that they are safe for proper internal usage. In fact, it gives you directions on how to use them. Um, these, the labels are different, but you guys, it's the same essential oil that Young Living has always, always made. In fact, this right here, this bottle of lemon, when you decide to restock your little bottle, your little Vitality bottle of lemon, because this is much more economical, um, it's the same oil. This is just labeled for dietary use, and this is just labeled for topical and aromatic use. Um, it's just that we at Young Living really like to work within FDA compliance and speaking compliantly and sharing compliantly. So our labels just allow us to be able to share the third way that you can use essential oils, and that is internally. Um, the lemon vitality, oh, I already went over that. So. A great way to use Vitality oils is by putting them in an empty vegetable capsule. Uh, you can get them from Young Living, you can get them from Amazon, you can go to the health food store. They're just little clear veggie capsules um, and you just fill it up and take it with a glass of water. I love doing that with um, lemon in my water or lemon in a capsule. I love using Copaiba in a capsule, Thieves, all that good stuff, all those Vitality oils. Uh, but you can also add those Vitality oils to water or juice or tea, especially if you're needing some serious immune support. Try a little Lemon Vitality and Thieves Vitality in your tea and you are going to feel so much better. How many of you love using your Vitality oils? Give me all the hearts for the Vitality oils. And maybe share some of your favorite ways to use them for other people to see how you like to use your Vitality oils. So like instead of using a lemon wedge at a restaurant in my water, I can have this in my purse and just put a few drops of lemon Vitality oil in my water because you guys, this isn't acidic. It's not gonna hurt my teeth or my digestive system and it's super detoxifying and supportive of my immune system and my body. And so I would rather use this than a lemon wedge. Um, but the only thing that I'd say is that make sure when you're using citrus oils that you only use glass, ceramic, or metal because these essential oils are so powerful. They help break down petrochemicals in our body, but they will do the same thing to any plastic container that you put them in, which is amazing. They don't hurt us. I can take this lemon oil and I can put it on my skin. I can rub it in and it's not going to hurt me whatsoever because I am a natural living creature, human being. But if I take it and put it on like styrofoam or plastic, it's going to start breaking down those toxins and chemicals and it flushes them out of our system, which is awesome. So in with the good, out with the bad. You can even cook with oils to enhance your food. I have made some really yummy things with Vitality oils and I can't wait to start baking. I got some ginger and nutmeg and clove and all that good stuff and I can't wait to bake some things with my Vitality oils. Another reason why it is so important to apply Young Living essential oils topically and use them internally is because they are very high in antioxidants, especially this lemon oil. This stuff is amazing. Um, and create a very unfriendly environment for free radicals. Free radicals come from sources outside your body, such as tobacco smoke, toxins that we apply and use every day, the food and water we drink, the pollutants in the air, our homes, like all sorts of things that we come in contact all the time. Those, those antioxidants help fight those free radicals. And you want to know what else free radicals do to our bodies that is not good? They make you look and feel older. No thank you. I don't want to look and feel older. 
Um, I want to slow down that process for as long as possible. I am 39 going on 40 and I want to feel like 29 for the rest of my life or for as long as I can hold out. So I'm going to be fighting those free radicals like crazy. You better believe it. Uh, free radicals damage and attack your body daily. Um, but there is a defensive action that you can take. Essential oils and especially our Ninja Red drink. So Ninja Red. You get two packets in your premium starter kit, which is awesome because I love that people get to try this because it's so amazing. So you get two packets in your premium starter kit. Um, are the highest antioxidants you can find anywhere. In fact, they come from the Ningxia region of China. They are wolf berries with all sorts of other good stuff, but it mainly has these wolf berries, which are just goji berries on like crack. They're just super amazing. Um, and the highest antioxidants you can get. So you think about that, you're getting the highest antioxidants you get so you can fight those free radicals the best you can. Um, so who drinks Ningxia Red daily? I do. Um, don't you love it? It is like the most amazing thing ever. In fact, I have not drank my Ninja Red yet today. I got a little behind in all the things with getting all the kids out the door for church. So I'm going to drink mine right now. So this is what I do. I'm going to take two ounces. And I kind of know where that is on this glass. So I take two ounces. My favorite things to add to my Ninja Red daily are my Lemon Vitality Oil. Because that's also an amazing um, combatant against those free radicals. It has limonene in it, which is awesome. And I love to add my frankincense vitality. You guys, if this was good enough for Jesus, it's good enough for us. We should be using this daily. Frank vitality, so amazing for supporting our bodies and keeping them healthy and keeping some of those scary words away that we do not want in our bodies, especially as women. And copaiba, I love this oil. This is an amazing essential oil. Um, it's exclusive to Young Living. If you're getting it somewhere else, it may not be what you think it is. Um, I love adding copaiba. And then I add a couple other things. I add this mineral thing to it, but I don't have it with me right now because minerals are really important for our bodies. But and then I just drink it. Mm. Tastes so good. One of my most favorite things, especially this time of the day, is to add this to LaCroix and make like this sparkling ninja powerhouse energy boosting mom amazing makes me a rock star drink right all that in a all that in a drink amazing ah got my antioxidant for the day i never skip it um and when i do i notice a difference i notice an amazing difference so um so this is why drinking ninja red and using your essential oils daily is a must to give you those antioxidants you need and to help support your body system. This is why I love Young Living's monthly wellness box that comes every month, um, Essential Rewards, because my family needs to drink Ninja Red daily. And so this is a must to order every single month for us. And I love that it just comes straight to our door and we don't have to go hunt it down. Um, joining Essential Rewards is a key factor in really changing your health and your life because you're not having to think about getting all those products delivered to you every month. They just show up and it's amazing. So you can see consistency is so key when using essential oils and drinking Ninja Red. If you truly want to see a change in your mind and body and health, you have to diffuse these oils daily. You have to apply these oils and you have to be drinking and adding things into your body that are supporting your health and wellness as well. So, It'd be like comparing it to weight loss and getting in shape, like what I was saying earlier. You can't say, I'm going to eat healthy one meal a week and go to the gym one day a week. This isn't how it works. To lose weight and get in shape, you must work on it daily and be consistent with it. Wouldn't you agree? So using your oils and being consistent is so important. Um, so why would you choose Young Living and why did I choose Young Living? It was one of the things I did a ton of research on before I got started. I was like, why does it matter? There's so many different essential oil companies. I see them at the grocery store, I see them at the health food store, I see them all over the place. Why should I choose Young Living? Hey babe, my battery's gonna die and I need a charger. Husband for the win. I, I 
forgot to charge my phone. This always happens to me. I think I'm always having to plug my phone in, in the middle of things because I forget to charge my battery. Anyways, so Young Living is the largest and most trusted essential oil company in the world. Young Living has over 25 plus years of research and experience and is the only company out there with the seed to seal guarantee. It is a promise from our company that from the moment a seed is sourced to the time that bottle is sealed, Young Living uses the highest standards possible to make their products, your life and the earth better. Young Living has built nine farms around the world. That's not even including their partner farms that also uphold the Young Living seed to seal standard. No other company mm -hmm. has that. Young Living also loves for their members to be a part of the farming process from seed plantings all the way to harvest and distillation process. And I am so excited next summer to get to go and visit some of their farms in Utah and get to walk through the lavender fields and actually see their warehouse and their distillation um, and get to see firsthand what arrives on my doorstep every single month. Uh, Young Living completes eight different tests on every single batch of oil that is made. Nothing is compromised. The Young Living Seed to Seal goes beyond organic and purity. If you're buying oils that say organic, it doesn't mean everything that you think it is. Organic doesn't always mean that you are getting the best. This is why it is so important to know where your oils are coming from. Who would love to go with me and see the seed to seal process at one of the farms in person, right? I am so excited. Um, so the fact is essential oils are God given oils and work perfectly with our bodies to help support them. Oils are mentioned over a thousand times in the Bible either directly or indirectly. And anytime you read about incenses or perfumes or spices and ointment, they're referring to using essential oils. Essential oils are potent gifts that are powerful. And in order to prevent the misuse of these precious oils and ensure their maximum benefit, please be sure to follow the precautions that I'm going to list in the description section of this video once I'm done. Um, because I really want to have this written down because using your essential oils safely and following certain guidelines is really, really important. Like, you know, you don't want to stick them in your eye. I actually did it once. It really sucked and it hurt really bad. But there's things that you need to know to do. Like you wouldn't wash it out with water because it doesn't do any good. You need to use carrier oil. So some of those safety precautions are important when you're using oils. They are potent gifts from God and it's important to use them properly. So, Young Living essential oils are totally and completely safe. We have used them on our youngest at two months old, and we, and even my grandmother uses them. So, they are completely safe. But it's really important that when you get start with, started with essential oils to invest in some reference material um, and just to ask a lot of questions as you are on this journey. Um, so, are you guys excited? Because now... I get to share with you about some of my most favorite essential oils and what comes in the premium starter kit. This is the kit that everyone gets started with when they begin their journey into young living. So um, my first oil, and you get this nifty little thing where you can put your oils. My first oil is probably one of my most favorite, has the most uses. It has the nickname, the Swiss Army Knife of Oils. Um, because it is the most versatile oil of all and it has literally a thousand uses. You could use this on so many things. Um, the scent is wonderful for relaxation. We use it at bedtime. It's calming. It's great to apply or diffuse at bedtime or even to add to a soothing bath. So you can take some Epsom salts, add some drops of oil, let it soak in and then pour it into your bath. And it's like being at the spa, you guys. Uh, lavender is also super supportive of your skin. I add it to my mascara to keep my mascara really fresh and you know good and it also supports and makes my lashes super amazing after they all fell out after having babies. So I actually have lashes now. Yay for lavender. So this guy right here, over a thousand uses. So many things it would take me hours to tell you all of them. One of my next favorite oils 
and let me be just honest, they're all my favorite, uh, is peppermint. And peppermint vitality is really invigorating and energizing. It has a really fresh mint aroma. You can use it as a dietary supplement because it is the vitality. Um, and it's, it's awesome for supporting a healthy gut. So really happy tummy, great. Uh, it can also be a new mama's best friend, especially if you're in those beginning trimesters. Um, and it just helps with all things digestion. Uh, so this makes it a great benefit to use maybe before a meal, after a meal, awesome. Um, and when you apply it topically, it's very soothing and cooling to the skin. So if you have like an irritation or something like that, it can be really soothing and cooling. In fact, one of my most favorite things to do in the summer is to make a DIY cooling spray and put some peppermint in there and just spray it and it just keeps you really nice and cool. Or if you're, you know, having some hot flashes or something like that, that might be really amazing to put some uh, peppermint oil in a little spray and just cool yourself off. We women all know that we are super excited about menopause and all those hot flashes and all that good stuff. Uh, my next oil, and I mentioned this one, and this is one I put in my Ninja Red daily, is lemon. And the reason I use this one daily is because this oil right here has L-limonene in it. Look that bad boy up. Seriously, Google that because it's amazing. And it helps detoxify and cleanse your body daily. So uh, this lemon oil is actually cold pressed from the, lime, the rind of the lemon. Um, and the citrus flavor just tastes really, really good. And it enhances the food flavor. I can't even talk right now. Enhances the flavor of your food and water. It's really, really, really high in antioxidants. So remember we were talking about that earlier and fighting those um, free radicals. You want to be putting this in your body daily. Yes, drink it in your water. Amazing, Justin. Um, but the other thing is, is that it's super, super supportive of your immune system. And you guys, this oil is such a great deal when you get it in the 15 mil. Such a budget friendly oil. Um, super supportive of, your, of a healthy immune system. But I also love to diffuse lemon oil uh, because it just is great for making my house smell good and cleansing and just all that good stuff. Um, and just so many more uses for lemon. It's another one of those ones I could literally go on forever a thousand uses. Uh, Copaiba, this is one I didn't really completely understand what to do with when I first caught it. And I was like, what is this oil? I just love to say the name. Copaiba. So uh, it just made me feel kind of cool to say it. So Copaiba, it has a really lovely scent. And it's actually in the Stress Away. And I love the scent of it. And it's another one that I put in my Ninja daily because I found out my muscles and my joints and all that stuff, it loves it. It's super awesome for all those things. Just keeps my muscles and joints happy. Uh, so Copaiba, uh, it just has a really rich, uplifting, woody smell. And I love, you can add Copaiba, it's very calming. So you could add this with your lavender oil when you're taking a bath with your Epsom salts and you're gonna feel like you are at the spa for reals. So Copaiba, it's also a magnifier oil. So it takes the properties of the other essential oils and makes them magnified. So kind of a cool fact. Frankincense, me and Frank, we get along. Frank is amazing, especially for your skin. I love it. So frankincense is one of the oldest essential oils. It's considered the holy anointing oil in the Middle East. Um, and you guys, like I said, if it's good enough for Jesus, it's good enough for me. Uh, so it can be used like in religious ceremonies. It's great if you like prayer time and quiet time. It can be really centering and calming to diffuse or apply. Um, and it is well known during the time of Christ and was one of the gifts given to Christ at birth. So again, good enough for Jesus, good enough for me, me and Frank. Uh, it's really calming and grounding when you're diffuse. And ladies and guys, frankincense makes you look younger, keeps your skin healthy, smooths out any of those fine lines and things that you might not want to be forming as you're getting older. I add this to my daily facial regimen. Yes, all ladies need some Frank in their lives. Uh, thieves, thieves, all things thieves. In fact, thieves is so amazing that Young Living actually has an entire line of stuff that is just made with thieves because it smells so good and it's so amazing. Uh, Young Living Thieves Vitality Essential Oil may will help support overall wellness and a healthy immune system. This is one that we are definitely diffusing a lot. 
and you will fall in love with this blend of five oils. It has clove, cinnamon bark, rosemary, lemon, and eucalyptus. And when I clean with my Thieves household cleaner, I literally feel like it's Christmas year round. It smells so good. It makes my house smell so good. In fact, today at church, I sprayed down all the tables and counters with it because I took it with me because I don't use their toxic chemicals. Um, and a couple people came in and was like, oh, it smells so good in here. And I was like, I know, right? Anyways, uh, so Thieves. Uh, I love to diffuse this stuff daily. In fact, my favorite combo right now is Thieves and Orange. It smells super fall and yummy. And we apply it to the bottoms of our kids' feet all the time. So our kids smell like Thieves. Uh, purification. Purification. I call this the stinky oil. And you know what? It doesn't smell stinky. It's because it takes away everything stinky in my life. So you may just want to make a spray and just spray your teens. I'm just saying. So this has about six essential oils in it. It's a blend. Um, and the cool thing is that you will never feel embarrassed by your house if you just cooked something really stinky or you have babies and you're changing diapers uh, because you diffuse this bad boy and it just knocks out every single bad stink in your house. Um, pets, cooking, laundry, teenagers, husbands, all that good stuff. You can diffuse it throughout your house or you can take it and you can put it like more targeted um, in your home or in your car. I love taking a little cotton ball and you can stick it in the vent of your car and then it blows and cleans out your car. Anyways, um, or you can make a DIY bathroom spray because we all know there's a lot of stink going in that going on in that little room. So you could make a purification spray that people, your guests can spray and then they're not spraying any toxic chemicals or you can add it to baking soda and freshen your carpet. So many good things. And Heather, I will get you some Christmas oil. It smells amazing. So there are so many uses, again, with this essential oil. This is like a mom's best friend. My other oil is RC. RC, I like to say it stands for respiratory care. And it helps with breathing. I don't know about you, but I like to breathe every day, all day. Breathing is good especially in the winter and fall months. Um, so we've been diffusing a lot of RC because we had some stuff going through our house. But this is also amazing if you apply it to someone's feet before they go to bed and they will sleep quietly. If they tend to not sleep quietly and they make a lot of noise and they're sawn logs at night, this right here is amazing. This helps you not to make a lot of noise while you're sleeping at night. Um, so applying to the bottom of feet, oh, I know a lot of athletes who love to use this because when you put it on your feet or your chest or you diffuse it right before you work out, it opens all those airways and so you're able to perform better. I know a lot of marathon runners who use this bad boy. So it has spruce, cypress, and three types of eucalyptus oil. It's amazing and I love the smell of it. Um, you can also use it when you're in the bath and it's like, it smells really good. Uh, this bad boy right here is my best brand. Dajaz. This mama loves Dajaz because I like to eat Mexican food and it makes my tummy happy. So Dajaz we use a lot. Um, in fact, I have a big 15 mil bottle that I got for free this month that I will be cracking open and using a lot during the holiday season. And probably tonight after Josh and I go out for margaritas and tacos at Applebee's because they have dollar margarita nut. Um, so Dajaz, it's amazing. Um, it's like your tummy's best friend. You can uh, dilute this and rub on your tummy. You can put it in your belly button. Um, it can be amazing during some of those sicknesses that like to come in the winter months when things are coming up out of your body. It can be very soothing during that. You can put it in a veggie capsule and take it with water. In fact, we do that a lot around here. We take this with a veggie capsule and thieves and peppermint and take it and it makes our tummies happy. This is like my number one go-to oil for tummy support. I do not leave home without this. In fact, I have like five bottles of this stuff and I stick it everywhere with my little veggie caps on the go. It's great if you're traveling and you might get, you know, pick up something while you're traveling. Uh, the other oil that I love is Panaway. I didn't know how much I love Panaway until, you know, this mama had some aches and intention and all sorts of stuff. This right here is amazing. 
Um, it's a blend of four oils. It does have this little cap that kind of some people are like, oh, why does it have like a childproof cap on it? It's because it has a really strong oil in it called wintergreen. And I don't know if you've ever gotten like mint or something around your eyes. You don't want your kids getting into this one because it is very, very minty. But it has wintergreen, clove, helichrysum. And helichrysum is a freaking amazing oil. And peppermint. You have any sort of discomfort, whatever, you want to roll this on your back, your shoulders, you've been carrying babies all day. This right here, pan away. I will never be without this oil. It has a really stimulating aroma um, that is very soothing also to the skin. So if you had some sort of like you were out in the woods and you came home with some stuff on your skin, it'd be really soothing. Um, but we really like to use this topically. And um, yeah, so the other way that I like to use this is we've diffused it a couple times. Uh, Josh woke up one day and he felt like his head was in a vice and he was dying and he was like leaning over the diffuser breathing this in. So it does have other uses, but we really try to conserve this bad boy because we love having it around. It's amazing. Okay, so the oil that I mentioned first, Stress Away. This is actually a bonus oil. Don't miss it. It's down underneath your box and it smells amazing. You can use this as a perfume. It smells so good. Everybody who breathes needs stress away. Seriously, I kid you not. Like, you need this oil. Especially us mamas, if we want our children to live, you know? There's a reason why animals eat their young sometimes. I mean, they're cute. God knew what he was doing when he made our babies cute, right? And our kids cute because, yeah, so stress away. So we don't, you know, eat our children. And stress away does what it says. It helps ease your stress and your everyday stressors. It doesn't take any stress away. It's not gonna fix your life. I wish it would, but it doesn't. It just makes it easier to cope some of those stressors. It can really help um, just relax and reduce that occasional nervous tension. And just, don't we all need some just stress away like every single day, every hour? I'm always like smelling it off my diffuser bracelet. Uh, but it also promotes confidence and a happy and stress-free mood for everyone, including pets. I have people who use lavender and stress away <coughs> with their pets, which is awesome because I don't know about you, but I know some people who have some nervous dogs. I just want to oil them, all the oils. But uh, my most favorite thing is to use this. I actually just like take this thing and I just roll it on like a perfume. So like a little behind my ears, maybe on the back of my neck. I'll put it on my wrists. I used to do this when we'd go into church with Sawyer uh, on Sundays and I just have him smell it and I could totally tell that the days I forgot to do that, the, the Sundays, he was way more agitated. So I love that it helps just also calm our children. Great at bedtime. So guys, as I wrap this up, may I just get super real with you for a second? I want to share something that really hit home with me when I heard this. And you guys, the reason that you're watching this or the reason that, you know, people get invited to my classes or they come to my classes is because they care about what they are doing with their families and they care about themselves and they care about their kids and they want the best. So, you know, when people are invited to my classes, it means that someone cared about them to invite them. So for whatever reason that you are watching this today, whether that's me or someone else, or you just happen to see this, or you come to one of my classes, like you are loved by the people who encouraged you to go and who wanted to share this with you. Um, but what I want to help you realize is that what is allowed in our products that we buy and use every single day. And this has been such an eye opener for me. I've been learning so much about how industries and companies make our products and what they put in them and how they cut corners and how they hide them. Um, and did you know that the number two cause of death in the United States is cancer? 1,620 people a day die of cancer. One in three cases in the U.S. is directly linked to poor diet, physical inactivity, and chemical exposure. You guys, those are all preventable. One in three cases are preventable. The American Cancer Society says that only five to 10% of all cancer cases are gene defects. That means 90 to 95% of cancer cases are under our control. 
or we can help those around us. It's in our control. It's what we allow into our homes and into our bodies. And I know those are really intense facts to swallow. When I read that, I was like, what? Really? Is that true? But you again, guys, again, knowledge is power and we need to change that outcome. There's a reason when they do biopsies of cancer that they remove from people, they find all these toxic chemicals in them because our body is trying to fight those off. Um, so I just truly believe that knowledge is power and knowledge, once we know better, we can do better. Um, and I know that you guys would agree, you want the best for your families and for your health. So it's time to tell those companies that we do not want their toxins and their chemicals and that we want to kick them to the curb and stop buying all their products that are making us unhealthy and creating a better future for our families and for our kids. And we are the ones who control what we allow into our homes and into our bodies. We are the gatekeepers of our homes and we have the choice to make our health and the health of our family a valued priority. And I know that's such a tough pill to swallow. I felt the same way, but you guys, we spend like over $200 a month for our phone bills, right? And we spend over a hundred dollars for cable to watch TV and we don't think anything of it, right? We don't think anything of it of putting those, those things in our budgets. But you guys, where is our health and the health of our children in our monthly budgets, right? Because our bodies are our most important investment, not our cable, not our phone, and yet we have those in our budget so easily. I want to express to you how life changing it has been since we and my family have started our Young Living journey. And I know that the other Young Living members who are watching this would agree and they have seen amazing results. Some things we can't change or we can't share because we have to share compliantly, but essential oils do these amazing uncompliant things all the time that I have seen lives change because of them. And so that is why I love to be able to share because I never know whose life will be changed by essential oils next. But it's about taking these small steps and using what you know now and doing something about it. You know better and then you do better. So getting your kit, joining essential rewards, using your oils, drinking Ninja Red daily, and then month by month, removing and replacing other toxins in your home. It's going to make a difference, I promise you. Making your family's health and your health a priority is worth it. You will never regret it because nothing matters more in life if we don't have our health. I would rather be poor than to be sick and unhealthy the rest of my days. So I think our health is the most important thing that we can invest in. And I want to live a life full of health, purpose, and abundance. And to do that, it has to be a priority. And so, I know that each of you value your health and your family's health, just like I do. So you wouldn't be watching this today if you didn't. You wouldn't be curious about essential oils if you didn't want to make your family's health and wellness a priority. Monty, I would marry thieves too, but Josh might have a problem with that. <laughs> so I'm so excited, you guys. I am so excited when people jump on board with essential oils, it is like the best thing ever. It, I'm so excited for them. I'm so excited to see the amazing results and for them to just fall in love with their essential oils. So that is the end of what I had to share today. But you guys get ready because it's going to be an amazing ride and you will be so surprised by all the things that oils can do for your family. And I am here to support each and every one of you every step of the way, including showing up at your doorstep to help you out. I swear, if you have a dusty kit that's just sitting there, I will totally come over to your house. And if you don't think essential oils work, I will come over to your house. Just try me. And uh, Sawyer's probably wondering where his mama is because he woke up from a nap and he's hungry. So I gotta go feed my baby. And yes, Josh, we make sure that Sawyer has nice, healthy, toxin-free milk. Loves it. Yep, that's Thanks. why we're careful about what we use on our bodies and in our bodies because everything goes to our kiddos. So thanks so much for joining me, you guys, and I hope you have a blessed and amazing Sunday. Be blessed, be oily. Bye, guys. Thanks so much for joining me.